Today we're doing a video on how to acknowledge a supplier acknowledgement for a change order on a purchase order. When you first log into Supplier Portal, this is the screen that you're going to see. The icon you're looking for is the one that says Supplier Portal, and that's the one you're going to click on. When you're in your front screen, the next thing you want to do is click on Manage Orders. To make it easier for yourself to be able to find your change orders, click on the Advanced button, go to Add Fields, and look for Change Order Status. When you get to the change order status, you wanna do the drop down and you wanna click on pending supplier acknowledgement. What this is gonna do is it's just going to populate the purchase orders that still require an acknowledgement on the change order. The row you're looking for is the one that says the change order with the number in it that does act like a hyperlink. So you're going to click on the hyperlink. When you're in here and your purchase order, the first thing you're going to do is hit the acknowledge button. You're going to go to actions and you're gonna to wanna to review the changes. When you review the changes, this is going to show you the changes that the buyer has made to your purchase order. It gives you the dollar amounts that it changed from to what it's changed to. And it shows you the item numbers down below as what had the changes had been made. Changed amount sits here. You're gonna go back up and you're going to hit accept if you're accepting the changes. Once you have accepted the changes, then you're going to hit the submit button and it's gonna ask you if the change order will be accepted, do you wanna continue? You're going to hit yes. Now, if for any reason you chose to hit the reject button, please always remember that you need a reason as to why you're rejecting our change orders. Thank you and have a nice day.